Alexa, reheat my one cup of coffee. Starting coffee, one minute, 15 seconds. Alexa, pop two ounces of popcorn. Starting popcorn, one minute, 46 seconds. Hey, what's up, folks? How's it going? This is Waj. Hope you guys are all doing well. That was a quick demonstration of what the Amazon Basics microwave can do. It has a very simple and straightforward interface. It looks very much like any other ordinary microwave that you find all over the world. But of course, it has that Amazon Alexa integration. Now, the setup of this thing is actually super straightforward. You plug it into the wall, you open up the Amazon Alexa app, and then you just simply add it to your list of connected devices. The time will automatically be set, which is probably one of the easiest ways to set up any uh, kitchen appliance that I have ever experienced. So that's definitely a big highlight. Now, there's essentially three ways to use this microwave. The first way is the good old fashioned way where we put something in and set the time, press start, pretty simple, straightforward. The second way is uh, to push this button down here where it will cook for two minutes. Use the echo to initiate a voice response. Uh, the third way, we'll stop this. Alexa, stop the microwave. Okay. So the third way is basically where you ask Alexa independently without using the button. So Alexa, cook the microwave for two minutes. Two minutes, power 10. Now there's certainly a lot of drawbacks to this system. Firstly, there's no microphone built inside to the microwave itself. So you're pretty much forced to have an echo device nearby where it can hear you. And that could be fine if you're in a small space, but if you have a larger space without multiple echo devices, that could certainly be problematic. Secondly, you have to be very specific about your voice commands. Now I know Amazon Alexa is pretty advanced in terms of its voice command features, but if you don't give it a specific set of instructions, so you have to say microwave, this and then also give it a specific duration or the amount of mass that you're cooking uh, it won't uh, initiate your command so it's very fussy about that Alexa add another two minutes to the microwave sorry I'm not sure about that Alexa microwave for another two minutes And there's certainly no deep learning or further analysis of what's being microwaved on a frequent basis and it will kind of learn and adapt uh, to your needs accordingly. It's a very simple and rudimentary system, which isn't surprising because this is a microwave that's under $60. It comes at a budget price point and essentially besides having uh, this voice activation feature, it uh, neither detracts or adds uh, from the overall end user experience that you're getting from this thing. Lastly, another major issue is if you haven't used the microwave for a while and want to initiate a standalone voice command, you're actually forced to get up, open the microwave door, or press the Alexa app to actually use the voice feature, which definitely takes away from the convenience factor of this thing. But besides that, guys, that's really it. Now, if you have any specific questions about the Amazon Basics microwave, let me know. Uh, check out the description down below. I know there's a, a couple of different packages with a, an Echo and the microwave as well, which could be a good deal for some of you guys out there looking for something kind of unique with a special gimmick like this. But besides that, give us a thumbs up if you like this quick overview, and we'll see you real soon. Take care.